This will be an installation for the Satima Spring Base on a K-Series safety catcher. Lay out all of the spring base components. Start by sliding the o-ring and plastic spacer over the bottom plate. You will then slide the bottom plate into the housing. The plastic spacer should rest on the inner lip of the housing. Now you can mount the bottom plate and housing to the Satima safety catcher. With a rubber mallet or lead hammer, give the bottom plate a tap. Once the bottom plate is flush on the catcher, align the six holes. With the bolts and lock pin washer supplied, mount the bottom plate to the catcher. The lock washer tab will need to be face down to pin. Snug the bolts down with a wrench. You may need to use a flat head screwdriver to help set the washer tab in location. Take the supplied pin and tap it into shown hole on the bottom plate. You can now set the four springs in the shown location on the bottom plate. Set the catcher upside down so that the spring base is accessible. Line up the flange plate with the springs and location pin. Using two 12 millimeter long bolts with nuts, you can put the bolts through the through holes on the mounting flange and thread into the bottom plate. Once the bolts are installed, you can now start compressing the spring using the nuts on the bolts. You only need to compress the springs enough for you to see the snap ring groove in the housing. Now you can install the snap ring into the housing. With the snap ring installed, remove the two nuts and bolts. You have now successfully installed a Satima spring base on a K-series safety catcher.